Welcome to Tip Tuesday with the YMCA Employment and Immigrant Services. My name is Stephanie and today we'll be going over tips on how to make your workplace the new normal. Tip number one, before you enter the workplace, you will expect it to perform a self-assessment, including a temperature check. Your employer may ask you questions such as, do you have any new or worsening symptoms, such as a cough, shortness of breath, runny nose, or a sore throat? Have you traveled outside of Canada or the province in the last 14 days? Do you have a fever or have you had close contact with anyone who is suspected or has a case of COVID-19? It is important to be aware of your symptoms in order to report them properly to your employer. Tip number two, knowing the difference between quarantine and self-isolation. Quarantine means that you have no symptoms. However, you have traveled outside of the country in the last 14 days. You have had close contact with someone who is suspected to have COVID-19, or you have been told by public health that you may have come in contact with someone with COVID-19. Isolation means that you do have a diagnosis or you are awaiting lab reports of your COVID-19. Even if your symptoms are mild, you should still be self-isolating in order to keep your workplace and your coworkers safe. Tip number three, masks and hand sanitizers. It's going to be a huge adjustment going from speaking face-to-face -face with customers or clients to suddenly standing six feet back and wearing a mask. However, even if one party is wearing a mask, it cuts down on the spread of COVID-19 and helps flatten the curve. Although we've learned hand washing from a very young age, we should always be proactive in washing our hands every hour and using hand sanitizer in between. Remember to wash your hands for at least 20 seconds with warm water and soap. Tip number four, working from home. Even though a majority of the province of Ontario is in phase three, working from home is likely to continue for the foreseeable future. You should continue to feel comfortable in your home while working, so having a designated area is important. At the end of the workday, you should feel like you are able to power down and still enjoy a work-life balance. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to reach out to the YMCA Employment and Immigrant Services with any questions or to learn more about our services. Contact information can be found online at www.ymcaofniagara.org or the information section on our Facebook page. Have a great day.